First things first, let's demystify the term double die obverse. A double die occurs during the minting process when the die, the metal stamp used to strike the coin, is engraved or impressed with a design that is slightly off-center from the original hub. This results in a doubling effect on the coin's image, creating a distinctive and often mesmerizing appearance. Now, when we specifically talk about the obverse of the coin, we're referring to the front side. The side usually featuring a portrait, emblem, or significant design. Double die obverse coins are a numismatic marvel because of the intricate patterns and double details that make each coin truly one of a kind. Double die obverse errors have occurred in various US coinage, capturing the attention and interest of numismatists around the world. Here are some of the most popular and well-known double die obverse issues in US coinage. 1955 Lincoln cent. Perhaps the most famous example of a double die obverse in US coinage. Notable for strong doubling, especially in the inscriptions and the date on the front side of the coin. Highly sought after by collectors and enthusiasts commanding pretty impressive premiums at auctions. According to PCGS record-breaking sale was realized at Stax Bowers auction. This DDO cent was sold for $114,000. 1969 S. Lincoln cent, features a prominent double die obverse with clear doubling in the date and obverse letterings except the mint mark S. Considered one of the most significant double die varieties in the Lincoln Cent series. Record breaking sale was realized in 2008 at Heritage Auctions. This highly elusive specimen ended up selling for $126,500. 1972 Lincoln Cent. The Cherry Picker's Guide lists nine different varieties of double die obverse 1972 cents, but FS 101 is the guide book variety most in demand by collectors. The obverse legends exhibit a spread that approaches the famous 1955 FS 101. The present crisply struck superb gem showcased at Heritage Auctions, offers booming luster and unabraded orange-red surfaces. It was sold for $14,400 in 2019. And there you have it, fellow collectors. Our exploration into the fascinating world of double die obverse coins. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to CoinOz for more numismatic adventures, and ring the notification bell so you never miss a Cointastic update. If you've had any exciting encounters with double die obverse coins or if there's a specific topic you'd like us to cover in future episodes, drop a comment down below. Until next time, happy collecting and may your coin discoveries be as unique as the double die obverse coins we've explored today.